Actress Jennifer Lynn Connolly was born on 12 December 1970 in Cairo in the Catskill Mountains of New York State, USA, of Irish ancestry. The daughter of Aline and Gerald Carl, Jennifer Connolly started as a child model but is perhaps best remembered for her portrayal of Marion Silver in the science fiction movie Requiem for a Dream in 2000. So, just how rich is Jennifer? As per the estimation by Celebrity.Money, Jennifer has a net worth of over $32 million as of early 2017, mostly accumulated from her career as an actress, which began in the early 1980s. The daughter of an antiques dealer and a clothing manufacturer, Connolly was raised in Brooklyn Heights near the Brooklyn Bridge. She attended a private school specializing in arts, St. Anne's, and although her family moved to Woodstock, New York in 1976 in order to escape the city smog, she returned to St. Anne's four years later. At the age of 10 and at the suggestion of her father's friend, she auditioned as a child model, which was the first step to her career as an actor as well as a model. Having begun modeling at the age of 10, Jennifer appeared in her first movie at the age of 11 and in another nine by the time she was 20, but with little acclaim. It was in the 2000s that she finally found recognition through movies like A Beautiful Mind, winning an Oscar, Golden Globe, and BAFTA Award, and Requiem for a Dream. She also starred opposite Leonardo DiCaprio in the movie Blood Diamond, which was commercially successful, so boosting her net worth as well as her fame. She has now made almost 50 appearances in movies and TV series, among them Aloft, Stuck in Love, and Noah in 2014, opposite Russell Crowe. Initially, finding romantic comedies suiting her talent and personality, she has eventually come to play a variety of mature roles in movies. Even at an early age as a child model, Connolly had been portrayed in magazines such as Muppet Magazine in 17, and was later included by Time, Vanity Fair, Los Angeles Times, and Esquire in their list of world's most beautiful women. She has also been a face for Revlon Cosmetics, and all indications of her admired good looks. Talking about her personal life, Connolly began a relationship with fellow actor Billy Campbell while filming the movie The Rocketeer but they broke up in 1996 after five years. She then had her first son with David Dugan in 1997. She married Paul Bettany in 2003 in Scotland, whom she had met during the filming of A Beautiful Mind. The couple now shares three children and live in Brooklyn, New York City. As an aside from acting, in 2005, Connolly was named as an ambassador for human rights education by the Save the Children Fund. 